Stay informed with Shufti Pro's weekly IDV news, from new regulations to emerging technologies. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay updated with the latest developments in the industry. Ireland's government created a separate team in the Department of Finance to ensure Dublin becomes the headquarters for the EU's Anti-Money Laundering Authority. Turkey's government remains on FATF's grey list as it fails to comply with anti-money laundering and counterfinancing terrorism regulations, despite implementing effective mechanisms to combat financial crimes. The Hong Kong Securities and Futures Commission has warned all platforms working on virtual asset about regulatory non-compliance and urged them to comply with regulations. Australian banks Bendigo and Adelaide have banned high-risk digital transactions to protect their customers from financial crimes and to curb money laundering as a source of virtual assets. The House of Delegates amended the American Bar Association Model Rule of Professional Conduct, which covers declining and terminating the representation of clients during the ABA annual meeting in Denver. A memorandum of understanding has been signed between the Dubai Financial Services Authority and the Financial Intelligence Unit of the United Arab Emirates to advance cooperation and the exchange of information regarding anti-money laundering control and the prevention of terrorism financing.